test. test.
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Mount Zion Girls Soccer between your Mount Zion Braves and the Matt Toon Green Wave. I'm Blake Faith, Braves TV sponsor, doing the play-by-play. -play. Lucas Reynolds on the camera, and possibly assistant coach Weirman will join us here on Color Commentate here in a moment. But we are ready to go for Mount Zion Girls Soccer Action Apollo Conference between Mount Zion and Matt Toon Green Wave. Braves looking to get the first kick here as number nine, Kendall Allen, will take kick is off for us here in a moment. And we are underway as Kendall Allen gets it back to Maddie Kendall. Kendall dish has the pass to Swarthout. Swarthout tries to get it through, finds the feet of Allen back to Swarthout. Swarthout looking middle, pass is almost deflected, takes a touch, goes out to green wave number 10, Brooklyn Redfern. Ball's going to go in the middle now, cross, and Chloe Kunst is going to have to come off her line, grab the ball, and gets the first touch of the ball, ball game. Kunstel drops off, but gets it to Maddie Kendall. Kendall looking, gets it to Howerton. Howerton going back over, gets it out to Claire Horn on the right wing. Horn takes a touch, passes it. Ball's going to take a deflection, end up on in the feet of Sydney Howerton. Howerton gets the ball stripped. Looks like it's going to be a shot. It's going to go on goal. That is one save now for Chloe Kunstel as Kunstel rolls it back out once again. Kunstel gets the ball off to Howard. Howard gets it to Horn. Horn looking to go down the line. Horn brings it back. Ball's going to be called out of side. Matt Toon, Lady Wave throw in. Throwing will be took. Ball's going to trickle back out to number nine, Lauren Hone. Or, sorry, Bella Mass. Ball's going to trickle now for the Braves as the ball's going to go all the way back into the second third here. Ball's going to go sail. Looks like it's going to stay in bounds. Howard, or no, they're going to bring the flag. It'll be a mountain sign. Braves throw in. Claire Horn will take the throw in for the Braves. Horn throws it into Sydney Howerton. Howerton gets a touch on the ball. Howerton goes up the right flank, gets a pass. Another flag, it's going to be a green wave throw in. Throwing the ball from the green wave, it's going to be number 10. That's Logan Christ, or sorry, Maggie Greer. Ball's going to go out, trickle out now to Sydney Howerton. Howerton gets the pass to Maddie Kendall. Kendall gets a touch on it. Ball's going to come out to the feet of number six, Marley Van Hoven. Ball's going to trickle back out. Going to go back and forth here, hand up in the hands of Gear. Gear gets a touch. It's going to go back to number eight, Brooklyn Redfern. Redfern trying to thread the needle here. Ball's going to go out of bounds. I believe it's going to be a goal kick for the Braves. Elena Howard will take the goal kick for the – or no, sorry, Brooke Boston's come back to take the goal kick now for the Braves. Boston takes the goal kick. Ball's going to go out, try to find the feet, goes off the leg of gear. It's going to be a throw-in for the Braves. Brooke Boston will take the throw-in now for the Braves. Boston throws it in, gets it off to Maddie Kendall. Kendall trying to get out to Swarthout. Swarthout gets a touch, saves it in bounds. 
ball is going to be covered by the Greenway. Chloe Kunzel comes off her line and grabs it once again. Kunzel rolls out to Brooke Boston. Boston tries to get a pass off. It's going to go off the Greenway. It should be a Braves throw in. Or they're going to call it off the Braves. It'll be a Greenway throw in. Taking the throw in is going to be number 22, Bell Shriver. Shriver gets the ball in, goes off the head of number 19, Reese Updergoff. Howard's trying to clear it. Ball's going to sell to bounds. Greenway throw in. Shriver will take the throw once again for the Green Wave. Shriver gets it in. Ball's going to take a touch, go on the feet of number nine, Bella Mass. Ball's going back up. Braves, Peyton Swarhow gets a touch on it. McKenzie Krieger gets a touch. Tries to get off to Kendall Allen. Allen's going to get through. They're calling her onside. Allen with one person to beat. Allen trying to get the breakaway go. Allen shoots it, whiffs it. It's going to go out of bounds. It'll be a rain wave goal kick. That was a missed opportunity there for Kendall Allen. That could have been the game the goal that broke the scoring open as it's going to be 0-0 still. Greenway goal kick. I thought Kendall Allen might have been offsides there by a smidge, but they called it through. So I was explained to by our Mount Zion scorekeeper up here that if she was before the 50, the defender was before the 50, so there's no offsides. Game is still 0 0, 35 10 left in the first half. Ball's going to trickle back out to Boston. Boston now drops it back to Howard. Howard tries to get a touch on it, slips on it. Ball's going to be picked up by number six, Marley Van Hoven. Hoven goes up the right flank. Good play by Howard to recover. It's going to be a Mount Zion goal kick now. Way to get back on your feet, make the play for Howard on that one is the goal. Is the prevent the breakaway goal as the core score remains 0-0. Boston now will take the goal kick for the Braves. Boston gets it up, gets it over the top, going to go off the feet of gear. Krieger's going to get on top. No, Kendall's going to get on top of it. Kendall gets the pass to Sidney Howerton. Howerton now trying to go up the right flank. Ball's going to be kicked back out. Howerton's still going to get back on it. Howerton battling for it. Ball's going to go out of bounds. Braves throw in. Claire Horn will take the throw in for the Braves. Horn looks to throw it in here. Horn throws it in, gets it all the way out to Maddie Kendall. Kendall now trying to split the team. Ball's going to go off and defeat a number nine mass. Mash tries to cut it back, battle for the ball. Claire Horn's going to come up with it. Horn out trying to get it away from Mass. Mass will come back up with it. Mass keeps it in bounds, gets a pass off. Maddie Kendall tries to get a stop on it. Howard, though, takes the deflection. Lands on the feet back on now to Mass. Mass will take a shot on it, goes from far right, goal kick for the Braves. Brooke Boston, luckily, to take the goal kick once again for the Braves. Actually, Claire Horn will take it this time around for the Braves. Horn looks to take it, gets it off now to Howard. Howard gets a trip. Ball's going to trigger out to Swarthout on the left flank. Swarthout trying to come with the gears, trying to go with it. Howard gets it. Howard gets it off the foot of gear, but they're not going to say otherwise. It'll be a green wave throw in. Taking the throw is going to be number 22, Shriver. Shriver's going to get it in. Maddie Kendall's going to make a play on it. Kendall gets it to Krieger. Krieger now lays it off to Sidney Howerton. Howerton in a foot race has to get there. Howerton gets a touch on the ball. Howerton lays her out. Ball's going to go out of bounds. It'll be a brave throw in, though. They're letting him play early on this one. Horn takes the throw and gets it off. Going to go off ahead. Going to land on the feet of Mass. Or sorry, that's number six. Kunzel's going to come up with it. Kicks the ball out. Clears it away. Ball's going to trickle out all the way to Paint Coaster. Howardson's going to try and make a play on it now. Ball's going to go out of bounds. Greenway throw in.
what's that number? Lauren Home will take the throw in f- for the green wave now as Home gets the ball out. Going to trickle out now as number 12, Maddie Keeters, will make a play on the ball. Keeters keeps it in bounds, tries to get a pass back out to a brave. Ball's going to be stolen by Sidney Howerton. Ball's going to be delivered into the feet of Mass. Ball's going to be cleared out by Maddie Kendall, throw in for the green wave. Taking the throw, it's going to be number 22, Shriver. Shriver throws it in, trying to get ahead of number 19 up to graph. Ball's going to go out of bounds off the foot of, I believe that's Brooke Boston, Greenway throwing. Taking the throw, it's going to be number 9, Mass. Mass throws it in, gets it off the head of number 6, Van Hoven. Braves throw in, or Braves goal kick, sorry. 0-0, zero, zero, 10 minutes into the match. Two real opportunities have been Kendall Allen's breakaway goal and then the giveaway by Howard that ended up being a, a, kicked out of bounds by Howard to c- keep the game scoreless. As Claire Horn takes the goal kick, Mackenzie Krieger gets the head off, gets it to Maddie Kendall. Kendall now get, has to get a playoff, gets it to Krieger. Krieger now with some open space. Krieger takes a step at it, gets the pass off, trying to find Allen. Ball swooped away. Goes all the way back out now to number nine. That's Mass. Mass drops it back out to number 22, Shriver. Shriver now trying to go up the right flank with it. Shriver finds a pass, goes through the Braves' defense as Elena Howard now trying to clear it for the Braves. Howard's just going to let it ride. It'll be a goal kick for the Braves. Claire Horn will take the goal kick once again for the Braves. Horn takes the kick. It's going to sail out to Gear. Gear's going to get on top of it. Passes up to Up to Graf. Up to Graf goes off to Shriver. Shriver now trying to deliver the ball inside. Sidney Harrods gets a touch on it. Mass will come up with it. Gets the f- foot off. Will go out to numbers. Go out to now. Sorry, Claire Horn will try to make a play on it now for the Braves. Kendall trying to steal it now. Boston's trying to clear it. Howard will now get a piece of it. Takes tries to clear it out. We'll get it all back to Shriver. It's Mackenzie Krieger now will intercept it. Krieger now trying to go up the left flank. Krieger now tr- go, goes up the left line here. Two m- m- Greenway the b- beat. Gets it off to Swarthout. Swarthout passes it to Kendall Allen. Allen now gets a touch on it. Gets the ball almost to Krieger. Swarthout might be able to get a play on the ball. Swarthout has a touch. Gets it back out. Ball's going to come all the way back out to Brooke Boston. Way to get the ball, keep the ball on that one. Boston gets it out, trying to get a pass up. Going to go up to Maddie Keeters. Ball's going to come out. Maddie Kendall now with it. Kendall goes with it, gets the pass to Krieger. Krieger, what a good first touch. Tries to get the ball over the top to Coaster. Green Wave keepers got to go off her line. Oh, the ball's out. The Braves still trying to get it, and it's saved once again by the Green Wave goalkeeper. Two opportunities for the Braves to put in the back and F. Come up short so far here in this game. Claire Horn comes up with it. Horn get, f- slips. Tr- Mass will now take her on. Mass trying to go up the left flank. Mass delivers the ball in. Howard's going to dr- make a run on it, trying to keep it in keep it in bounds for the Braves. Howard's just going to clear it. Matt Toon laid it Green Wave throw in. Greenway, they're going to have some substitutions here. I believe number 23, Jorana Halderson, will check in the ballgame for the Green Wave. Shriver delivers the throw in. Shriver's going to get it back, tries to get a little bit of a shot on it. Howard comes up with a touch. Ball bounces around in there. Kunz is going to come off her line and grab it. Kunzel with the punt gets out to Maddie Kendall. Kendall now trying to get a pass at the left line, trying to find Swarthout. Swarthout's pass is intercepted by number 26. That's Stewart. Stewart gets it back to Shriver. Shriver gets a pass inside, finds the feet of Van Hoven. Mass takes a shot. Kunzel gets the save, and we are still scoreless 0 0 26 minutes into this game. 
Hunsell punts it away. Krieger now with it on her feet. Krieger now tr trying to lead her offense. Krieger with the little step over, gets it back in their feet. Gets the pass off to Swarthout. Swarthout takes a touch, gets it to Kendall Allen. Allen now one person to beat. Allen settles it, finds the feet of Kendall. Kendall now right outside the 20-yard line. Kendall gets the pass to Coaster. Coaster now trying to get the right flank. Ball's going to roll out of bounds. It'll be a Mount Zion corner kick, first corner kick of the match for either team. Coaster will take the corner kick for the Braves. Coaster takes it. Ball's going to find a foot of Allen, going to trickle all the way back out. It's going to be a Mountain Zion throw in now. Coaster will take the throw in for the Braves from the looks of it. Coaster looking for an option, get, jumps it back to Claire Horn. Horn now takes it back, so going to get stripped. Pass is going to sail out now. Greenway trying to advance it here. Greenway, they're going to try to advance it. Howard in a foot race. Kunstel comes off her line, grabs it, though, and secures it for the Braves. Kunstel trying to punt it away now. Kunstel's not going to have any options. The ball's going to sail to bounds via Greenway throwing. All right, joining us is going to be, once he gets his breath, is going to be, is it current or former Mount Zion assistant boys coach Chris Weirman is doing the color commentating today? Current or former? No, man, it's still current. It's still current. It's still hasn't, current. hasn't gone yet. Still an assistant coach. Oh, of course, of course. <laughs> coach Weirman, as, I'm, as we're going back into this so far, 0-0, 24 minutes in the first half. Brace had two opportunities. Kindle Allen with a breakaway goal, shanked it far left. Hmm. And then Peyton Coaster almost got it in on a little bit of a breakaway shot. Good. So right now, as we're seeing it, Swarthout now will get the ball for the Braves, delivers the pass off the left flank, gets it to Krieger. Krieger now goes up with it. Krieger now a lot of space to operate with. Krieger looking for the pass, gets it off to Kendall Allen. Kendall Allen trying to do the one-two. Krieger's going to get on She's top of Blake. it. Oh. Krieger, oh, it's going to take a touch. Krieger might be able to rebound it here. Krieger looks back, is looking for the drop. Krieger steps back, is trying to get inside there. Krieger's going to take up the mm -hmm. line, takes a shot. It's going to go off the green wave. But they're calling it a goal kick. Well, missed opportunity. I think uh, maybe line judge kind of saw it different. But that's good work by Krieger on that side. Absolutely. Krieger kind of in the central attacking midfielder role today. Goal kick is about to be off and away by Hilgenberg. Going to end up on the feet of Kendall. Kendall now to Howerton. Howerton trying to get it back to Kendall. Ball's going to sail back out to number nine, Mass. Mass trying to get it to Howerton. Mass taking on Howerton. Mass gets through, gets through a pair of Braves. Kendall's going to get a foot on it. Ball's going to bounce back. Kunstel will come off her line once again and get the, keep, contain the ball. Kunstel will get the ball off to Boston. Boston now takes a shot. It's going to go over the top, land on the feet of Howerton. Howerton with a bad touch, though, as it goes back to Mass. Mass trying to get inside. Ball's going to find the feet of Van Hoven now. Ball's going to sail out of bounds. Going to be a Braves throw in off the foot of the green wave. Yeah, so we're going to get a substitution here. I believe that's Gracie, Gracie Larison will check in the ball game for the first time, replacing Pate Swarthout on the left midfield wing. Go ahead, Coach. No, I was going to say it looks like wind's a little bit of factor. That ball's Absolutely. going to run, run a little hot on that turf, of course, but that wind sure doesn't help. Yeah, it's a very windy day. We moved our camera inside just in case the rain comes, and they started the game 15 minutes earlier just to try to get ahead of the storm. As that ball's going to be thrown into paint and coaster, ball's going to hit the hands of Howerton as she battles for it. Ball's going to trickle out all the way to the feet of Maddie Kendall as Shriver's going to come off and try to grab it for the green wave. Shriver's going to come over with it. Shriver now is going to get the ball stripped and stolen by Howard. A little bit of a foot race here. Foul's mm. called. It's going to be called on the green wave on Howard. Howard's been playing really scrappy today. Early in the game, Howard kind of made a stumble and fall, got back and made a play on the kit. The game scoreless as well for the Braves. Great. Great stuff by the young uh, the young freshman. Fullback, yeah. 
Ball's going to be taken for a shot. Kunzel's going to make a save on it. Off the rebound, and there's the goal as the game is now not scoreless. Number, number six, that's Van Hoven scores the goals. We are now, the Green Wave now lead this one one to nothing. Those are dangerous, Blake. Those are dangerous because that ball's, ball's running hot like that. Keeper has either one, one option to catch the ball or, in that case, try to knock it down and then get her hands on it. The other team was there. We just didn't didn't have somebody in there to help her out so absolutely as a former keeper myself i used to hate when that happened to me those are tough absolutely one to nothing now green waves lead this one with van hoven with the score here boston now will get the ball up the ball's going to go out of bounds unlucky going to be a green wave call throw in here shrivers will take it once again for the green wave Shriver gets the throw in, going to stay in bounds. Boston trying to make a steal on it, does, just kicks it out of bounds mm -hmm. and clears it, bring wave throwing. We're going to have a substitution here for the green wave. Checking in the ball games, checking back in the ball games, going to be number one, Gracie Willingham. Shriver trying to throw the ball in, gets it in. Going to take a touch, laying on the feet of Howerton. Howerton now just trying to get up with it. Howerton comes up with it, trying to get it out. Hands on, lands on the feet of Mass. Another shot, high arcing shot. It's going to end up in the hands of Kunsel. Kunsel now with three saves, four saves on the ball game, sorry. Horn trying to come up with it. Horn gets it, trying to go up the left flank, right flank here. Horn drops it back, looking for an option, not really having much luck of anything. Yeah. Going to go out of bounds, Green Wave throw in. Kind of got Green Wave are playing quick now. They're kind of smelling the blood in the water here as they scored the first goal of the ball game. Ball's going to trickle out, laying the hands of Kunzel. Kunzel now trying to reset her defense, find an option, punts it away, a high arcing punt, trying to get to Krieger. Bad touch by the Green Wave, going to end up on the feet of number five. Lily Gregory, Kunzel will come up with it once again. Good Kunzel. stuff by Kunzel, man. She has to play aggressive. They're, they're playing long. They're playing long. They got the win. I mean, that's that's going to probably – That's the green wave way of soccer right there, just playing aggressive yep. and trying to get that first goal in the blood of the water. Ball's going to come back out to Van Hoven. Hoven's trying to mm. thread the needle. Claire Horn got a foot on it. Ball's going to sail out of bounds. Should be a green wave corner kick. That's all right. Great job by Claire to break that up because she had a little bit of a lane there. She had she had options once she, she got around. So. That's good stuff. That's right. We'll take the corner. Better a corner kick than a goal. Yeah. Yeah. Matt Toon's having a decent season, I see, Absolutely. this year. Absolutely. They yep. tied Muhammad. It was their last game of the match of the year so yep. far. Ball's going to be delivered in. Claire Horn once good again stuff. being the right person at the right time. Ball's going to trickle back out. Maddie Kendall trying to get on top of it. Kendall gets it to Krieger now. Krieger and the Braves trying to go with it as oh, Kendall Allen's on the right wing. Flank gets it off to Gracie Larrison. Larrison trying to do a one-two. No, she'll keep it. Goes up the left flank. Gracie with two people to beat. Larrison gets the touch off. Pass is going to go back out. Claire going to land up on the feet of Claire Horn. Horn's trying to keep it up. Ball's going to trickle back out to Gregory now. Gregory is going to come up with it. Howard comes off her line to keep Mass from getting the ball play on the ball. Mass defended by Howard. Ball's going to sail in. Looks like going to sail out of bounds. Should be a Braves goal kick here. I'm going to tell you what, that last play Braves had up there, Kendall, Kendall Allen made a great diagonal run. Absolutely. They didn't quite find her in space. She did a great job holding on sides. I mean, you could tell she's kind of getting a lot more experience now when they got a defense that's trying to hold these kids. So, Absolutely. Kendall Allen kind of learned on the fly last week in Charleston. There's a lot of offsides calls. Allen yeah. had to learn her goal. But Allen, so far this season, has been a goal scorer and freshman for these Braves. Yep. Had two last week in the win against Charleston. Ball's going to sell out now to Gear. Ball's going to do a 1-2. Van Hoven gets it too far out for Gear. It's going to be a Braves throw in. Taking the throw in for the Braves can be Brooke Boston. This team is super young, composed of mostly freshmen and sophomores outside the three junior captains yep. and the lone senior, Maddie Keeters. I butchered her name all year last year when I tried to pronounce <laughs> oh, her Oh, yeah, name. absolutely. Yeah. Weirman sometimes is also our scorekeeper up here and the <laughs> one who delivers the calls. The other one is Doug. Ball's going to sell it now. Van Hoven tries to get a touch on it. Van Hoven somehow keeps it. They're going to call a high kick. Mm -hmm. Braves, Braves will get the free kick here. 
Taking it looks to be Howard or Boston. They're kind of talking over it right now. Boston will take it. 17 minutes remain in the first half. Matt Toon leads this one 1-0. One Matt Toon kind of only has two shots on goal as of right now. One of them was the back of the net. Ball's going to sail back to Howard. Gear's going to make a play on it. Gracie Larrison trying to fight through. Sydney Howerton now will scoop it up for the Braves. Howerton makes a touch. Ball's going to go out of bounds, but they're going to call it a Braves throw in here. Gracie Larrison will take the throw Oops. for the Braves. They're going to give a redo on that one as the ball's going to take a touch off gear. Krieger, though, battles for it. Krieger's now trying to take on two defenders. Ball's going to come off the feet of Mass. Yeah. Ball's going to be delivered in. Going to go all the way back out now. Kunzel just might as well let it ride here as it'll be a goal kick for the Braves. We'll have another substitution checking back in the ball game. It's going to be number 23, Horun Aldorson. Hmm. Claire Horn will take the goal kick once again for the Braves. Horn delivers it in. It's going to go all the way out now. Going to find the feet of Keeters. Keeters trying to do a 1 2 combination. To Kendall, ball's going to go right back to the green wave here. Kendall's trying to run it down. Howerton makes a play on it. Krieger's going to get a touch on it. Now Krieger with some open space finds Howerton. Howerton now trying to get a dribble off. Howerton gets it back to Krieger now. Krieger has some options here. As Krieger's going to take it down the left flank. Krieger finds the pass he wanted, gets it to Gracie Larrison. <laughs> Larrison's going to get the ball taken from her. Ball's going to trickle all the way back out to Boston. Boston gets it to Howerton. Howerton keeps it inbound. Try and get the pass off to Larrison. Howerton battles for it once again. Kendall Allen coming out of nowhere, trying to get a touch on the ball. Ball's going to trickle now to Van Hoven. Or sorry, that's Mass. Mass now tri dribbles it up the field. Mass tr keeping it right at the ball at her feet now. This ball's trying to get ripped. Boston will end up ripping her. No, she's still going to have it. Mass Oof. gets a shot. Hierarchy shot up in the field goal. It is good. It'll be a Braves goal kick, though. No goal. Yeah, one of those, one of those, uh, you know, deep runs. I think once Mattoon gets going, I, uh, defenders once they once they learn how each other plays a little. One probably per, uh, defender may, may say I got ball. The other one kind of plays off. But um, all in all, you like you like shots out that way. Absolutely, keep, keepers got a good chance at that. So I I was always preached at by our coach in high school, low and into the corner, not high arcing top shelf. So. Yeah, we'll take anything outside Van Hope, the Yes, Van, yeah, absolutely. As the defense, absolutely. Shot's yeah. going to go off for Mass once again. Once again, the field goal is good as it's going to be another Braves goal kick. Of course, I say that, and these girls are putting some pretty good shots. <laughs> Absolutely. They're trying to. They're trying to put them on frame. Absolutely. Uh, they're not bad shots. One of those, one of those finds just you know, below the bar, that's, that's going to be a nice rip. But you, almost, you almost want to you want to pressure them to shoot from outside, but also you want to at least get someone to step out there as Claire yeah. Horn will take the goal kick once again for the Braves. At the very least, maybe get them on a foot they're not used to. Something. Number eight for the Green Wave is back in the ball game. That's Brooklyn Redfern. Ball's going to go out now. It's going to trickle out now. Kendall Allen trying to make a play on it. Maddie Kendall is going to come up with it. Ball's going to end up in the feet of the Green Wave. Krieger now trying to sneak in there, trying to get a touch on it. Krieger's battling in there. Gets it to Gracie Larrison. Larrison finds the pass he wanted. It was going to go to Kendall Allen. Ball's going to be scooped up here by number five. Lily Gregory, ball's going to take a bounce. Gregory's trying to get it back in there. Keeters is going to battle for it. Keeters now trying to get to the feet of Kendall. Kendall now looking for a pass. Gets it to Larrison. Larrison now with a good idea there. Ball's going to go out of bounds. I think that's going to be a brave throw. No, Gracie Larrison's going to keep it in bounds. Ball's going to go off the feet of Howerton. Howerton drops it back to Boston. Boston finds the pass to Gracie Larrison. Larrison gets it to Howerton. Kendall has to come over because it goes right over Howerton. Going to land up in the feet of number one. That's Willingham. Pass is going to be delivered in. Van Hoven's going to make the stop on it. Van Hoven get, brings it back. Shots taken by Mass once oh, again. Oof. Goes right over the hands of Kunzel. Goal kicking. That one would have been on frame if it wasn't for the wind, I feel like. Yeah, yeah, that's not helping. Wind's not helping. Absolutely on not. I wonder if we got a little too much space there right around the 40-yard line. I think, I think maybe 
couple of our outside middies or, or whatever the plan, a 4-3-3, they can maybe drop in and, and maybe disrupt a little bit. They're letting Mattoon set up a little bit. Absolutely. The ball's going to trickle back out of bounds. It'll be a Braves goal kick once again. I believe Peyton Swarthout's getting ready to check back in the ball game for the Braves. She'll check back in. Looks like she's swapping back out with Gracie Larison here on the left midfield line. The Braves kind of in a 1-3-2-4 right now. Or maybe a 1, yeah, 1-3-4. One, is Kendall Allen's the lone striker. Mackenzie Krieger, Peyton Swarthout, and Peyton Coaster are the center mids and the center attacking mids, and Kendall and Howard's in the center defensive mids. Kendall gets a play on the ball. Kendall looking for a pass, trying to get to Coaster. Ball's going to trickle back out to Redfern. Redfern trying to get the pass up. Kunzel comes off her line. Man. Kunzel grabs it. Well done. As a green wave is going to tumble over, but Kunzel will not get called for that. She did her job. It's not her job to stop. It's the attacker's job. Kunzel gets the punt off, gets it to paint and Coaster. Coaster lays it off to Kendall. Kendall now looking to pass. Gets Great the ball, pass Kendall. all the way out to Kendall Allen now. Allen trying to make a run on it. Green wave is going to whiff it, it's gonna, but it's going to snub out the Braves' attack there. Ball's going to trickle back to Howerton. Howerton trying to come up with it. Howerton battling, as always, one of the three captains for this team. Ball's going to trickle out, goes off the hand of, head of Van Hoven as Mass is going to get a touch on the ball here. Mass has been the one that's kicking it from 40 yards out. As she gets into some space once again, let's see if she winds it once again for the shot. She's going to drop it off. Keeters is going to disrupt the Green Wave offense. Keeters gets out to Krieger. Krieger now looking left, gets it to Sidney Howerton. Howerton drops it back to Boston. Boston now looking to get a pass on it. Boston's going to take the shove through the contact, keeps it inbounds. Sword out, trying to make a play on it now. Shriver comes up with it. Howerton now trying to battle for it. Ball's going to trickle back out to Mass. Mass defended by Kendall. Mattel's gonna, Mass is going to take the shot once again. Ball's going to go over Kunzel's hands. I'll take a corner on that one. Miscued, but save for, for Kunzel. Fifth save of the game. But it's going to be a green wave corner kick. Yeah, that line drive shot, I mean, there's no doubt the wind kind of helped carry that thing. But, I mean, as a keeper, you're right. You almost got to eat that one in your stomach. And, and yeah, and absolutely. You if you're not, just punch it away. You can't afford but, for it to go over your head like that. Because, I mean, that's a game of inches right there. Could have rolled right in the back of the net. It was well struck. Good ball. Good ball absolutely. by Matt Toon. Corner kick from the green wave. It is delivered in off the, I believe, the belly of Claire Horn. Kendall's going to get it, though. Ball's going to trickle out. Krieger now will come. No, Peyton Swarthout now will come to that as Krieger leaves her. Swarthout now goes off the left line. Swarthout looking for a pass, keeps dribbling it. Had the pass just a little off. Howerton gets it. Howerton now gets it over. Now if Allen can get to that ball. It's going to be – oh, Cal Allen will get to it. Allen now oh, trying to take in. on two defenders. Oh, Allen there takes the shot. Oh. Oh, a little bit left is it's going to be a – wait. They just point to the corner on that one, or is no, that a goal, kick? a goal kick? Goal kick. Checking back, I think ball game is going to be number 10. That is Maggie Gear. Gear. Oh I feel gosh. like, yeah, I feel like Gear's like a common soccer name, even though Gear retired last year from the soccer program in the Mattoon. Is that, is that Gear's daughter, maybe? It has or? to be Lily Gear's sister, I would oh, feel sister. like. Yeah. I would feel, well, which is also would be, yeah, yes, yeah. Coach, Gear's, Coach Ryan Gear's daughter. Yeah. Pretty strong soccer family, no doubt. Absolutely. They're known for it in Coles County. Gear, head coach for the Mattoon Boys and Girls program. Last year, the Green Wave. Kind of. <laughs> Doug said it, but our score person said, kind of like the shoemakers here in Macon County, which he is absolutely right. Even a few though, of those. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> One of them just took over the Mount Zion boys head coaching job not too long ago. That's Bryce times. Shoemaker, right? You bet. You yep. bet. Older brother of Luke, who I got to cover here for two years. Cousin of, Luke. cousin of Luke. Oh, cousin of yeah. Luke. Oh, so it's Hayden's older Hayden's brother. Hayden's older so, brother. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, Hayden, who just committed to playing soccer at Illinois Wesleyan not too long ago. Yep. Braves going to get a free kick here. Looks like Claire Horn's going to take it. Less than about eight minutes left of the first half. Green Wave lead this one one nothing. Got off a rebound, a little garbage goal. They banged in by number six, Van Hoven. Braves have their opportunities. Horn delivers it in. High arcing pass going to go over the top of the defense. Krieger gets a settle on it. Krieger takes a shot trying to tip the keeper himself, and the field goal is up and good. I like it. I like, I like the idea. I like the aggressiveness from Krieger. Krieger... Last game against Charleston, the only game they had last week on the road, Krieger was in the center back position, kind of center defensive mid. 
Game was tied 2-2. They moved Krieger up to the front. She scores two goals in the second half yeah. to, give him, to give the Braves a 4-2 lead. Krieger now trying to come up with it once again, going to find the feet of Howerton to Kendall. Ball's going to be stolen by Mass now. Mass trying to get it, get it ahead. She's been the one taking the shots from the long distance here as Howerton makes a step on it. That's it. Boston tries to eat it. Gear gets a pass off. Howerton intercepts it. Howerton gets the pass to Kendall. Kendall now trying to get a pass. Great ball Payne by Coaster, Kendall. if she can get there, it's a great ball. Coaster does. One touch outside. Ugh. Oh, the touch ball's going to go out of bounds. It's going to be a Mount Sinai Braves throw, and that's just a game of inches right there. Yeah, Maddie Kendall's touch on that ball was brilliant. Absolutely. That, that just landed at the feet when she was running. Coaster had, had a great ball on the run. This game might be opening up soon for the Braves. We'll see as the ball's going to trickle back out now to Kendall. Kendall trying to make a play on it. Kendall gets a pass. Going to go back. Greenway is going to clear it. Going to go back all the way out to Claire Horn. Ball's going to go out of bounds. Greenway throw in. Yeah. We started this game about 15 minutes early due to the concern of rain. We brought our camera back inside due to the concern of rain, and now it's looking like we're going to get a sunny day after all. <laughs> That's so weird. That Macon County Adium bubble is real, believe it or not, folks. So I keep weird. saying it. Maddie Keeter's now with the ball here in the defensive third. Keeter's trying to get the pass out. It's going to be a green wave throw in. It's going to be another substitution for the green wave. Checking back in the ball game. It's going to be number 19, Reese Updegraff. Well, they're cycling players. they got Absolutely. fresh legs. I mean, at And they're cycling the few key players as Howerton now is going to steal the throw in now. Ball's going to come all the way out. Allen trying to make a play on it. Ball's still bouncing around. Howerton trying to get to it. No. Mass is going to take another hierarchy shot. Cool. It's going to go off the crossbar. Kunzel made oh, a save on it. Kunzel's going to pick up the loose change. What a save by Chloe Kunzel. Man. Seven of them so far on the ball game. She rolls it out to Krieger. Yeah, she had to stay with that one, too, Absolutely. so she did a great job. Absolutely. Way to make the save and then just keep with it. Krieger now with it, trying to get off. Five minutes remain in the first half. Swarthout tries to get a pass, gets off to Kendall Allen. That's it, Kendall. Allen gets it off to Howerton, looks like, or maybe Coaster. Howerton now is going to get the pass through the needle to Coaster. Ball's going to be too hard and touch of a ball. It's going to be a green wave throw in. I like the way the Braves' offense is looking so far against Mattoon. I mean, one nothing game, I'll take it right now. Yeah, they're finding the corners, man. I think Absolutely. they got space out there if they can just keep that ball and play a little bit. Absolutely. As that ball's going to go back out to Masto. Howerton, oh. there is no quit in Howerton. We're going to get a – Entry timeout here. Looks like maybe a bloody lip, yeah. bloody nose. No contact, maybe to the face. You said number two. Number two is the injured player for the green wave. She looks to be Sophie okay. Gherkin. Looks to be okay. Just kind of hold maybe a nose or a lip or something. Maybe have a little, a little something. Leaking maybe they out didn't of there. take the piercing out. Who knows? Yeah. They do the, they do do the clear piercing sometimes. She was hitting the mouth yeah, as well. Yeah, it looks like she's probably just leaking, leaking a little blood. That's all. One of our soccer parents leaks in her. Nate Patrick said she was bleeding on the mouth, so we'll take his word for it. Ball's going to sail up to up the graph. Howard, though, trying to make a play on it. Howard has kind of been that emerging center back that the Braves have needed so far in the freshman class. The ball's going to come ball. out to Howerton. Howerton gets a pass on it. Coaster now oh, she's got get, two. She's latches got two. on. Coaster's got two options here. Coaster brings it back. Left footed shot. It's going to go off a of foot. Howerton now with it. Huh. Howerton takes a shot. It's going to go off the <laughs> foot. Landon Mass. Mass now bringing it up the field. Kendall now trying to get back on her. Mass is looking for the pass. It looks like she wanted number 11 to stay closer to her. Gets the pass to Gear. Number 11, Lathrop, is going to latch onto it. Lathrop's trying to cross it in. Yeah. Kunsel once again. Kunsel with another big-time grab. Kunsel having one of the, maybe one of the best games for a young Braves career so far. Boston's going to get with it. Gear's going to scoop it up. Lathrop now. That'll be go back out. Whew. Up the graph, tries to take a shot, going to go off the back of Howard as Howerton now will take it. Howerton with plenty of space. Howerton gets this pass off. Kendall Allen comes out with it. Allen trying to thread the needle to Coaster. Ball's going to sail back all the way now to Maddie Keeters. Keeters will get a touch on it, gets it to Claire Horn. Horn trying to go up the right wing here. Peyton Coaster now trying to go, gets the touch she wanted. Coaster now going up the right flank, gets a pass. Oh, Kendall Allen is. now. There Kendall Allen can score this. Oh, no, man. Kendall Allen has been 
It's going to be a Braves corner kick. Kendall, oh, no, it's going to be a brain wave. Yeah, I don't know how they didn't touch the keeper, but, but maybe. I don't. That's got to be. Well, yeah, that's what I you thought, wanted. I had that as a green wave save, but uh, this game is going to break open eventually for the Braves. Kendall Allen with another almost beautiful goal right there. Yeah, you can tell they're knocking at the door, man. They're getting there. Absolutely. They're Claire Horn will throw it in once again for the Braves. Horn trying to switch the field, gets it to Kendall. Kendall now trying to make a play on it, gets it to Krieger. Krieger with some open space, gets it to Allen. Allen gets her foot wrapped around. Krieger trying to break it up. Going to go back out to Mass for the green wave. Mass trying to deliver a pass. Going to go off the head of Howard. Lothrop will latch, on, latch onto it now for the green wave. Lothrop finds up the graph. Up the graph, trying to get a pass. Howard, though, being the sweeper type fullback she is, gets the ball out. Going to go out of bounds for a green wave throw in. Yeah, that was well defended, man. Howard needed to step on that and probably get that thing out of bounds. They were number, number two for the green wave. That is Sophie Gherkin checking back in the ball game. Green wave throwing once again. Green wave trying to get it in a hurry. Gets it up, up the graph with the ball. Howard defending. Up the graph tries to lay it off. Going to go back to Fita up the graph. Howard's going to come up with it, though. Howard's going to get out to Howerton. Howerton now trying to get a touch on it as Mass will come up with it. Howerton tries to strip her. Howerton, what a scrappy player, the junior captain. Howerton gets it to Kendall Allen. Now Allen just needs to get to Coaster. Coaster trying to get there. Coaster's going to latch onto it. Coaster gets a touch. Ball's going to go out of bounds. There'll be a brave throw in. One minute remaining in the first half. Matt Toon leads this one one nothing. Let's see if the Braves can knock on the door and get this game tied. Just a shot on goal, I feel like, would give him confidence going into the second half, right, Coach Wehrman? Oh, man, we got the win second half. That might kind of give him a little lift. You know, they might not have to work as hard at getting the ball up the field. But. Absolutely. So the ball's going to trickle back out to Keeters. Keeters gets the ball to Howerton. Howerton now will get it. You get a touch on it. Ball's going to sail out of bounds. Braves throw in 35 seconds remaining in the first half. Braves got to hurry here. Howerton gets the throw in, gets it up the line. Ball's going to take a touch. Allen's going to get a touch on it. Ball's going to be cleared. Howard just should have to – Howard's going to shield it all the way back so Kunso can grab it. I think this will be the last play of the ball game – or last play of the first half as the ball's going to be scooped out, passed out to Howard. Howard looking to clear it. It's going to go to Boston. Five seconds remaining. Let's see if the Green Wave try to make a play on it. Doesn't look like it. We'll have the first half ending. Matt Toon Green Wave lead this one month nothing. We'll be back after intermission.
And we are back for the second half here. Green Waves to lead this one, one nothing. Blake Faith, Braves TV sponsor with the play-by-play. -play. Lucas Reynolds on the camera joining us is assistant boys coach Chris Weirman. So far, we've had a Mountain Zion has been scoreless, but they sure had their opportunities, right, Coach? Yo, man, they had a couple, couple good, good little plays up the wing, and then maybe uh, Kendall Allen had a, a real good shot right before the half got drawn to an end. But we'll see what happens. Wind kind of wind is still picked up. It was, was first half. It might, it might favor the Braves a little bit. They won't be able to kind of send long balls. They meaning Mattoon, and and I think sometimes that can be be a little tiresome, kind of running up the field and then got to run back 40, 50 yards uh, on Absolutely. a long ball. But as Kendall Allen will now will have it. Allen now trying to get the pass in. Allen's going to come up with it still. Krieger trying to get a touch on it. Ball's going to trickle back out. Going to land on the mm. feet, I believe, of Upton Graf. Upton Graf now trying to take on Kendall. Gets the ball out to number two. That's Sophie Gherkin. Gherkin now trying to take on Horn. Gherkin comes back with it. Goes off her back. Gherkin now trying to drop it back. Gets the pass out to Massey, as we were corrected <laughs> at the halftime break. Upton Graf now gets the ball. Upton Graf gets the ball as does Boston's going to intercept here. Boston looking to switch the field. Going to go off the feet of Willingham. Ball's going to be tried delivered back in. Horns, sorry, Gherkin's trying to get on top of it. Ball's going to land on the feet of Massey. Massey's going to try to get a pass off. Horn's going to track it down. Horn's going to take a touch. Gherkin's going to try to be as rowdy as a cat there. Massey delivers it and goes right under the foot of Gherkin. Keeter's now trying to get there for the Braves. Keeter's going to ke come up with it. Keeter's now trying to go up the right line, gets the pass to Kendall. Kendall gets the high touch. Kendall's going to stay on it, though. Ball's going to go out of bounds. Greenway throw in. Mm. Taking the throw, it's going to be number 20, Lauren Hone. Hone gets it in. Going to go off the leg of Horn. Goes back out to Massey. Massey delivers a cross pass. Ball's going to trickle back out to Upton Graf. Upton Graf gets a pass now up to the right flank. Ball's going to maybe go out of bounds. Swarthouse trying to get a play on it. As the ball's going to come back now. Shot is took. Yeah. Saved once again by Kunsel. Kunsel, eight saves now on the match. Number 11. That is Lothrop with the Sean goal for the Green Wave. That was a good shot. It was kind of down towards towards the corner, at least tracking that way. So keeper had to get her hands on it. Those aren't always easy. Absolutely. Gherkin trying to get the pass out. Finds the feet of number eight. Howerton now gets the look at the pa pass now. Trying to get the ball up now. Gets it to paint Coaster. Coaster mm -hmm. wins the ball. Ball can be stolen by Van Hoven. Van Hoven, the lone goal scorer of the game so far. Ball's going to trickle in. Keeter's trying to make a play on it. Gherkin now has it. One man to beat. Gherkin slips and falls. Great no call by the refs on that one. Ball's going to find a foot. Gherkin's trying to come up with it. Ball's going to be won by Howerton. Howerton delivers the ball up the field. Yeah. It's going to go over the foot of Van Hoven now. Coaster on a foot race here. Ball's going to go out. Ball's going to be out of bounds. Braves throw in. Braves, if they operate quickly here, could get a goal here. Paint Coaster will operate quickly. Gets the ball out to Krieger. Krieger gets a touch on it. Krieger gets a little shove in the back. Krieger mm. somehow keeps the ball inbounds. Krieger now gets the drop back to Coaster. Coaster now trying to settle it. Ball's going to go out oh. of bounds. Uh, I don't know if it was Green Wave. Yeah, They're I calling agree. it Green Wave throw in, but I don't. Uh, yeah, I saw it different. That's a tough one. Yeah, absolutely I did. Yeah, that was good by Krieger to recognize that, try to get the ball into play quick, see if she can get something to happen, catch Absolutely. them on their heels. But. And she kept the ball in right. bounds right. It just kind of stood stationary there. As now we should have a Mount Zion throw in. Claire Horn will be the throw will throw it in for the Braves. Gets it in, finds the body of Allen. Allen keeps the ball. Allen gets the pass off. Krieger with it. Krieger mm. drops it back. Howardson kind of takes a shot. Oh, there Kendall's going to come up with it. Ah, going to go right over the net. Yeah, Kendall right idea. A, great idea there. Braves are knocking on the door. This game is should be, in my opinion, could go either way right now for the Braves when it comes to scoring. But they're going to get a goal on it as the goal kick's going to be taken by the Matt Toon keeper. Going to go out to Howerton. Howerton trying to get a play on it. Ball's going to sail back out to Upton Graf. Howerton was going to come up with it, though. Mm. Howerton gets a little shove. Greenway throw in once again. Looks like we don't have a ball boy right now. So. Oh, they are. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> so. They're getting worked. I believe that's Breck Fink over there. I don't know, though. I can't really see my vision's kind of blurry all the way up with this. 
due to the track season, we're now kind of pushed back a row, so it makes it a little tougher to see. Mm. Ball's going to be brought out. Going to go all the way back to Howard. Howard's going to get ahead on it. Massey now on the feet of Hurd is going to take a high arcing pass. Ball should. It's going to stay in bounds somehow. No, it's going to trickle out Mount Zion goal kick. Hamels worked out for him, and that ball held up okay. Absolutely. Mattoon was good to get on that. She couldn't quite bring that down, but. This game has been a little bit different momentums at times. It feels like, oh, Mattoon's got the momentum. Oh, well, wait a second. The Braves are going to take it back. I forgot two subs now for the Green Wave momentarily. Oh, you like to see that. You like to see pretty good Absolutely. competition on both sides, no doubt. Absolutely. Brooke Boston will take the goal kick for the Braves. Boston gets the goal kick, gets it to Peyton Coaster. Coaster traps it. Coaster trying to take it off in the right wing now. Coaster's still in the foot race oh, for it. Coaster's go, battling. Ball's going to trickle out to Howerton now. Howerton gets it up the line. Coaster now can maybe latch on it here in the right flank. Little communication here between the green wave and the keeper as the ball's going to sail to bounds. It'll be a Matt Toon goal kick. Checking back in the ball game is going to be number 10, Maggie Gear, and number 23, Haroon Halderson. Yeah, Mount Zion's got to adjust a little bit now. they got the wind at their back, so so the balls are being being played. Maybe a little hot, but, hey, man, it, it – at times, sometimes you need to get the ball out, and this, this at times could kind of help them get out of the back sometimes. Just need pinned. one little bounce sometimes. That's all it takes. Yep. That ball's going to be sailed in off the foot of Van Hoven. Massey battling Howerton for it. Massey gets a touch on it. Massey trying to get off her right foot. Looking oh, it's to pass. well defended. That's Absolutely. all right. Absolutely. Massey gets the pass she wanted. It's going to trigger out to Lanthrop. Brooke Boston's going to battle for it, though. Boston's going to get a pass, gets it to Swarthout. Swarthouse stays with it. Swarthouse mm. somehow stayed on her foot with it. As now Howard will try to get a pass to Boston. Ball's going to sail out of bounds. Greenway throw in. Uh, the idea was there. She knew not to just blast the ball. I like that she's Absolutely. trying to maintain possession out of the back. I mean, she's looking for the pass. I mean, that's Absolutely. that's good, especially for a young player. Again, we talked about it earlier in the broadcast here. The Braves are a younger team. I mean, most of the players out there are freshmen and sophomores. I mean, you have the three junior captains, Maddie Kendall, Mackenzie Krieger, and Sydney Howerton. Yep. Chloe Kunzel is a junior, but other than oh, that, and Maddie Keeter is a senior. Is. As the oh. ball's going to go right in there. Was that Krieger, I think, up top, yeah. or, or one of the forwards that was, was, I think, trying to call that ball a little bit? Krieger she, and Allen were trying to go for it, and it just didn't work out. As Massey gets a touch on it. Looks like but Peyton Swarthout split. steps up, the freshman midfielder. Ball's going to go out of bounds, Bra or Greenway throwing, sorry. As Massey looks to be the throwing in for the break, or Green Wave. Massey throws it in, going to go off the head of the Green Wave, going to land, though, on the body of Allen. Ball's going to trickle all the way back, though. Boston will come up with it for the Braves. Swordhout looking to get a pass. Swordhout tried it. Ball's going to trick out. Maddie Kendall now trying to outrun Massey. Massey delivers a drop back. I don't know if Van Hoven was expecting the drop back as Van Hoven takes a touch on it. Van Hoven gets it back to Massey. Massey with options here. Massey gets it down the line to gear. Howard sweeps it up. No, Gear's going to come up with it. Claire Horn now going to oh, sweep it back help. up. Horn, good help. Horn is... A, Horn is a great – this Braves defense, I feel like if they get some time to mature, they're going to be – we're going to be talking about this defense for years to come here. I mean, you graduate Maddie Keeters, but you're looking at four, three of the four back are freshmen, and they're all having great seasons so far for this Braves team. Yeah, there was good help there. I think uh, number 10 on Mattoon kind of snuck by Howard, and then uh, great help to come back and, and steal that ball back. So I'd like to see that with the young crew. Absolutely. Ball's going to come now, get onto the feet here as Gear's trying to latch onto it. Battle for the ball. Going to go to number 23. Oh, Mattoon took a heavy touch Alderson. in space, trying to get on that outside, maybe a little too much. Braves throw in here. I believe Claire Horn will take the throw in for the Braves. 31 minutes remaining here in the second half. Horn delivers the throw in. Sydney Howerton finds it. Ball's going to ricochet. Going to go to the feet of Kendall. Kendall trying to get it to Krieger. Ball's going to sail in. Krieger's mm. going to get a touch on That's it. Some good work. Yes, but number five, that is Lily Gregory will come up with it. Gregory's still with it now. She gets to the 20-yard line. Gregory delivers a pass in. Battle for the ball. It's going to go back down to Massey. Massey's going to get some space. Oh, man, Massey takes a shot, shot, and she Whew. swifts it over the crossbar. Goal kick for the Braves. Man, man, Massey's not afraid to wind up with that. She's taken some shots in the first half from all the way out 40 yards and has been getting them on target, just making the Braves work. You know, what a right foot, man. That was Absolutely. a great shot. Absolutely. 
Massey is a junior right now for the Green Wave. Horn will get the goal kick. Gets it to Howard here. Howard trying to go up the right flank. Howard's pass going to sell out of bounds. Green Wave throw in. Ball's going to go in now. Going to go all the way back now to Keeters. Keeters trying to get a pass. Ball's going to be scooped up by, by sorry, that's Howard. Howard's just going to clear it away for Green Wave throw in. Kind of reset that fullback line. Oops. Absolutely. Clock's going to stop here. Oh, flag's down. I think all four flags are down. <laughs> it's very windy day out there, so who, know, oh, who knows? <laughs> We're waiting for play to resume here. Gives me a second to fix our clock. Still are in the multitask. Soccer is still a very busy game. As Howard's going to come with it defensively for the Braves. Howard just trying to battle for it. Gets the ball down now. Ball's going to trickle out to Claire Horn. Horn tries to get a touch with it. Gear trying to keep up with her. Gear's going to get it. Massey now comes over trying to do it herself. Massey looking to cross a pass. Gets it to Updegraff. Updegraff defended by Swarthout. Now defended by Howardson. Pass to Massey. Massey trying to get her right foot open. Mm. Maddie Kendall eats it for off her hip as his ball's going to trigger out to Krieger now and see if the Braves can turn this into offense. Krieger's going to get the ball to Kendall Allen. Allen's got some space. Does she get the touch? Allen got the oh, touch. She's got the inside. Now Allen's going to take a shot. It's going to be deflected. Going to come back out. Peyton Coaster looks to battle for it. Maddie Kendall's coming. Kendall's going to get a touch on it. Kendall looks to battle here. Might have gotten away with an elbow there, but they're yeah. going to call it. Greenway will get a free kick. A little late call there. Yeah, you hate to see that, but it was the right call. Yep, it was yep. the right call. I mean, yeah, you you should have. I don't know why he waited to see if there was going to be an advantage or not. Yep, yep. Good counterattack by the Braves. I think sometimes you get caught a little bit stretched. Uh, Absolutely. You get quick up the field, but I'm got to reset. Howard now gets the ball to Matty Keeters. Keeters now trying Oof. to get the pass off. Gets it to Claire Horn. Horn trying to look for a pass. Horn gets it up. Paint Coaster now with it. Coaster gets it. Nutmegs, the Green Wave defender. Coaster gets it now. Kendall Allen's going to take it. Kendall Allen with some open space once All again. Right. Ball's going to sail out of bounds. Should be a Braves throw in. As Peyton Swarthout will take the throw in for the Braves. The Braves are still in this. Still one nothing. Oh, yeah, yeah. S Swarthout gets the throw in. Ball's going to trickle back out to Massey. Massey might be their person, not, might be their X factor here. As Massey takes it up the line here. Massey's, Massey's good on the got ball. one person to stop. Oh, God, she's got that. She's got such eight a. wide open. And then they're going to call the offside flag, it's going to raise up. Be a yeah. Braves free kick. Massey just d keeps that ball right attached to her hip, and that's what you want out of a dribbler. And she's yeah, got her, that her beautiful up. right foot. It's, it, her IQ is there. I mean, yeah. probably calling her name next year if she's only a junior. Yep, solid player. Heads up, always. She's looking for options. She had two. She chose Absolutely. to go a little bit wide. She had, I think, eight running down the middle. Could have been an option for her as well, but offsides may have been may have been an issue. Maybe she chose to go right, but as yep, Brooke, great play by Matt Toon. Brooke Boss will take the free kick here tw as we're coming on 27 minutes left in the match. Braves trail one nothing here. Ball's going to trickle back out to Massey. Massey gets the pass she wanted. Going to be scooped up by... Number 12, Maddie Keeters. Ball's going to go off Lothrop. Lothrop, though, is going to get saved once again. Guess who? Chloe Kunzel. <laughs> Kunzel with a great game. We talk about her four center, four center backs, but Kunzel right now, nine saves. I mean, yeah, there's one goal on the scoreboard, but it was a rebound garbage goal, but sometimes you can't, you can't blame the keeper for that. You just can't. Yeah, right, right. I used to hate because I would, I would have average like 20, 15 saves a game for Eisenhower, and they'd talk about, oh, well, you still let four or five in. Well, it's like how many of them were rebound goals? Where are my defenders? Where are my center backs? Yeah, yeah that's tough. That's Absolutely. tough. Ball's going to trickle back now. Green Wave dropping it back. Kendall Allen's going to try to make a play on it. Ball's going to go out of bounds. They're calling it Green Wave possession. Checking back in the ball game, I believe, is number two. Gherkin. Ball's going to trickle back now. Pass is going to be delivered up high. Boston was thinking about just letting it right out of bounds, and now it's going to go out of bounds off her for a Mattoon throw in once again. Yeah. 
Braves trail this one one to nothing. Twenty five forty three remain in the match. Plenty of time. Absolutely. And it, I don't. I think the Braves have the momentum. It might look not as massy here. At, with the ball comes back out. Ball's going to sail out of bounds. No, Boston's going to keep it in. Or no, they're calling that a corner kick. Yeah, yeah. We passed it back. I think unlucky. I think. I think we tried to maybe pass back to move the ball forward. I think we just we just kind of maybe miss it or. Really, the communication maybe was lost in, in where the pass was intended. And I think Massey's taking the corner kick right now for the green wave. Yeah. Massey looks to deliver it in. High arcing ball gets the way she wanted it. Oh, dear. Those balls are oh. dangerous. Fred, good clear by the Braves defender. The Kendall Allen with the clear. Ball's going to whip back in there. Yeah, Gregory's going to get in there, but Chloe Kunzel now with her 10th save of the ball game. Kunzel rolls it out. Massey now with the ball. Man, Massey gets something. it back to Lothrop. Lothrop trying to get a touch on it. Howard's doing all she can to get that ball back. Massey gets it back, takes off her left foot. Going to go all the way back out to Gear. Gear now with the shot. Claire Horn's going to swat it away, though, with her body. Ball's going to be took. Maddie Kendall now trying to chase it down. Kendall will get a touch on it. Kendall looking for a foot. Kendall now goes up the line. Paint coaster and Krieger right there. She's Matching. good at threading those, man. I tell Absolutely. you, Blake. Absolutely. That head picked up, and she saw the space between defenders. I think was hoping her girl would run through, but, but not a bad thought. Maddie Kendall, the junior, last two years she's been the leading goal scorer for the Braves. This year has been having a little bit of nagging injuries, but still having a good season for the Braves. She might not be scoring the ball like she used to, but she's definitely – using that passing ability to her advantage, notching some assists last week and in the season so far. And the Suns look like it's a bright, sunshiny day. We talked about earlier in the broadcast, we had to speed it up. It was 4.15 start. <laughs> and now it's like, wait, there's no rain coming. ADM bubble once again hitting it. Turned out to be a beautiful day. Absolutely. We've had a couple beautiful days this week, and then we're going to go down to 50s by the end of this week. Ugh. What's the high in New York this week, Coach, when you, <laughs> head, off to, when you head off? You're heading off to yeah. Thursday, right? Shorts. Ball's going to go oh, once again. No. no way. Massey's going to get netted once again. Or no, sorry, that was number eight on the goal. Brooklyn Redfern with the goal here. Maybe miscommunication there. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what. Uh, you know, maybe thought one of the fullbacks was going to help there, Kunzel, or or if she's going to put her foot on it, but. Absolutely. I mean, maybe misread. Matt Toon's probably got seven shots on goal, just <laughs> more shots on goal, at least 13 shots on goal, but only two have been converted so far. Yep. Braves still not out of this. 2 0, 23 19 left. As they make the switch, Kendall Allen's not going up top. Allen drops it back, gets it to Howerton. Howerton looking to pass. Gets it to the foot of Allen. Allen gets it to Howerton. Howerton has Swarthout. Swarthout now with the pass. Going to go with off the deflection here. He's going to triple back to Lothrop. Ball's going to trickle out once again. Swarthout's battling for it. Go all the way back out to Brook Boston. Green Wave trying to send it into Gherkin. Kendall now trying to make a read on it. Kendall just needs to get one little through ball, and she might have it here once again as Peyton Coaster kind of loses it in the sunlight. Coaster trying to go up the line here. Ball's going to trickle away out to Van Hoven. Van Hoven's going to kick it out of bounds. Braves throw in. Yeah, we just need to get organized up here. It'd be good. Absolutely. See you're, still, you're still in this game if you're the Braves. I mean, you're not sh oh, yeah, short no of doubt. anything. No doubt about it. Coaster looking to throw it in here. Gets the option to Maddie Kendall. Kendall now with it. Kendall trying to get his pass. Gets it to Krieger. Krieger gets it back to Kendall. Kendall gets oh, it to good, Krieger. Good what a ball here. Krieger gets out to Howerton with some space. Howerton nice. winds it up. Shot's going to get saved. What a shot there by Howerton. Yep. The punt's going to go away. Going to go right back to Howerton. Redfern with the ball. Gets it back up. Or Sorry, it's up to graph. Massey now trying to get a pass. Gherkin now. Chloe Kunzel has to come off her oh, line. Man. That's a dangerous ball. Oh, oh no. Gherkin's going to come up with it nets it in for the goal. As Matthew and Kreister lead three to nothing here. Yeah, gosh darn it. You know, the wind, I think, held that ball up a little bit. Once again, I think uh, Chloe came off her line strong. That wind just 
probably the ball died a little bit really late at the feet there and you got two options ones to run through it and man once you once you kind of get that far off your line it's kind of hard to recover absolutely it's just bad bounce there you want to make the right play on it but it's just nothing three nothing here as we get under back underway here paint coaster now with the ball for the braves trying to get a touch on it here going to go off the leg of number 20 that should be a barrier throw in coaster will take the throw in here Actually, now Claire Horn will take it. Horn looking to get the throw in. This is a tough week for the Braves as they got both Kendall Allen now with the shots, going to go far right. This is a tough week for the Braves. Today they have Charleston, who, or not Charleston, Matt Toon, sorry, who's second in the conference. Then they turn around and play Muhammad Seymour, who's first in the conference right now. <laughs> Checking back in the ball game is going to be number 25. Elizabeth Titus, and number 26, Molly Stewart. Goal kick coming for the green wave. Long high arcing ball. McKenzie Krieger gets a touch on it. Trying to get it to Kendall Allen here. Krieger's just going to take it now. Krieger settles it. Looking for the pass. Krieger now takes it. Gets oh, it off to ball. Allen. Here Allen just needs a go. shot. Ah, far left. It's going to be another goal kick. The Braves are put the pressure yeah. on. I love it. And Krieger just looks at Allen and says, hey, you had the shot. You're in the right direction. Head up. Yeah, that was a good play. Head up. Absolutely. You got to take that shot. Krieger did a good job to kind of create a little bit of space. Remember, Kendall Allen is just a freshman. So it's like, you know, you, you soccer is a hard sport to learn, especially in this tough girls soccer conference that the Apollo is in, that the Apollo is. Yeah, it's oh. Howerton goes go. down and she looks like she might be. Gets right back up. It looked like an awkward spill there for a second. Yeah. <laughs> Taking the free kicks looks to be Claire Horn. I mean, I like the way this Braves team look. I mean, if it's not this year, it could be next year. It could be a couple of years. And Weirman, me and you have talked about the upcoming freshman class they're going to get. Oh, uh, and, and the good news is the season's not even over. I mean, absolutely, not absolutely. That, I, if, of course, the, the regular season matters, no doubt about it. But, man, what kind of noise can they make in the postseason? You know, they're, they're still learning each other and, and what each other's strengths are. There's a lot of good stuff. And yeah. even this game, there's a lot of good takeaways. The score, absolutely. yeah, I got a little, a little bit out of hand, but it's, it's – uh, I, I mean, mean, it's two, It's a rebound goal and two little right, bad right. bounce goals. I mean, yep, yep. You'll, you'll learn from that. I mean – this game could be out of out of reach, but it's still not. Still plenty of time. Eighteen oh, fifty left. Yeah, we got eighteen. Minutes. These girls, all they need is one goal. One goal at a time. They just need to get. They just need to see the ball go in the back of net for the first time. And I think yep. it'll really break things open for these guys. Ball's going to go off the head of Horn. Maddie Kendall will settle it. Gets it back to Horn. Horn kind of switches the field, trying to look for a foot of a brave. Gets it out to Howerton now. Howerton up the graph, fight for it. Up the graph, wins the fight. Matty Keeters, though, stops her dead in her tracks. Gets it back out to Stewart. Massey now with it. Matty Keeters, though, trying to get it, rip it from her. That's Massey spins, gets it to her right foot. She really likes that right foot of hers. Ball's going to go out of bounds. Greenway throw in. Ball's going to trickle now to Gherkin on the throw in. Ball's going to be called. I believe it's going to be a Braves free kick massey's tough man it's off the ball watch her off the ball she just puts herself in a good spot Absolutely. i think she's always an out she's she's giving the girls an out they know if they probably want to step on the ball turn around she's going to be in a good spot to receive it so it's tough when you got a girl that smart so you got to kind of almost almost man mark her a little bit you know and just kind of follow around make sure you're aware absolutely as we're going to get another call here it'll be a brace free kick once again as i believe we're going to have a sub here i believe it's number 16 Number 16, that's ball wag. Another freshman here on this roster. Looks like Brooke Boston will take the free kick here for the Berets. Looks like, she, oh, thought she was going to kick it short to Claire Horn here as Boston. Boston's now trying to take it. Now oh, Massey comes up and tries to make a play on it, so... 
All right, all right. So, yeah, the wind the wind moved the ball a little bit, I yeah, think. Yeah, I think it distracted Masu trying to make a play on yeah. it, which great. Free good, kick. It was a good play by her, so we're going to re-kick it now. Boston looks to kick it. Gets it ahead. It's going to try to find the feet of Coaster. Mm. The goalkeeper's off her line, and the ball's going to trickle out of bounds. Greenway throwing. As Ballweg will check in the ball game. Tough ball, man. If you can get a foot on that, that that, uh, that maybe see. changes things a little bit, you know. But She's going to replace Paint and Coaster. Hopefully we'll see Coaster back in the ball game here. Maybe a short little breather. Green Wave will take the free kick, goal kick here. Winds up. It's going to go all the way out. Krieger pushes <laughs> off, and Krieger's going to – Ah, Krieger, shoot. <laughs> it was a good body position Krieger until, is until a, she extended the arms. Krieger Jr. already committed to playing at Illinois Wesleyan. They're yeah. trying to spit the play here. Krieger gets it back. Krieger, though – as the main focus of the Apollo defense, <laughs> even against against the Trojans, she had a couple plays where they were very physical to her, and she ate it. She ate it. She could have had a PK. Instead, she uses it to her field, and she gets two goals against him. So let's see what she does here. Here we go. Here we she go. gets it right here now. Krieger settles it. Krieger, oh, Krieger now is ran yeah. over by Massey. That card's coming. And they're going to get a call that's here. Card. Yeah, that's got to be a card here. As Massey gets the yellow card, rightfully so. She just laid her out, and Krieger's still down here. I think God. she got hit in the head on that. That yeah. should be a red. She grabbed the back of her head. Don't oh, go on. Lord. That's not a good call here. We're going to take a short break here. So I mm. think we're going to be a minute. Braves lead this one, or Green Wave lead this one 3 nothing. as McKenzie Krieger slow to get up, hitting the head right now as both the coach and Fink are going to work her out. We're going to take a short break while we wait. Krieger, though, is going to get back on her feet, still kind of on her knees. I don't know if Dustin Fink's going to let her back in the game. We can only hope. Well, yeah, I mean, uh, no doubt safety's important. So, Absolutely. So if we gotta, if we got to ride the rest out, no, no worries there. We just want the girl to be healthy. And I think that he's doing the little concussion test right now on the field. We'll see if she's still going to have to come out regardless for at least a second, I believe. Yeah, she'll have to be cleared. Since the, yeah, since the coach and her are out. Paint Coaster is going to be her sub for now. Mackenzie stepped up intensity, no doubt about it. She was she was really trying to show a little she aggressiveness. Had effort, and, but yeah, uh, and that's kinda, one of those. That's where Massey kind of lost control on that one. Uh, I mean, tough play, hard play, hard I mean. play. But you got to keep your head in the moment. Even though uh, the intensity stepped up, that doesn't mean you go clocking people. Yeah, physical game, no doubt. Absolutely, as Howerton will take the free kick for the Braves. Yeah. That'd be nice here as Howerton raises her hand. Howerton takes it with the wind. Ooh. It's going to go off and over the crossbar. What a shot there by Howerton. Be a Braves corner kick. Fink still working on Krieger here as Maddie Kendall's going to take it. Maddie Kendall with the wind. She has a couple Olympicos in her career here as a Mount Zion Brave. Hey. We'll see what happens. Massey's coming back in. There's going to be another sub as well for the Green Wave. They probably will not get him in before the corner kick, though. I think Gear will check back in the ball game as well. Oh, it's great ball in. Oh, oh, almost over the Olympic right. goal. Great ball by Kendall as we're going to get some substitution. Massey will check back in the ball game. Gear and number 20, Lauren Hone. Mads with a great corner kick, just a little short of getting that, that post. I just sounded like I was Scottish. I, I, think was Krieger, I think they're going to send Krieger back in the game. She looks like she's ready. We'll see here. Goal kick's going to be up for the green wave. Going to go high. Goal kick going to go up to Upton Graf. Going to go on the feet. Mm. Braves trying to control it here. Going to go all the way back out to Howard. 
Howard trying to make a play on a Gherkin, though, is trying to control it now. It should be a Braves throw in. I think it'd be off Gherkin. There yep. we go. Braves throw in. Maddie Kindle's going to take it here. Let's see if the Braves can get rallied up right now with their Krieger right now on the bench. Coaster gets it. Coaster took it over the roll of Krieger. Ball's going to trickle out, go off of Gracie Larson. I didn't see her check in the ball game. Oh. Larson once again trying to protect the face. So she's coming also back, I believe, from a concussion protocol as well. Larson gets it off the feet of Allen. Allen now with a move inside. Oh, Allen lays off the pass. Coaster trying to latch onto it. Ball's going to trickle back out to Kendall. Kendall gets it to Sidney Howerton. Howerton with a pass. Ballweg trying to read it out. Ball's going to high arc. Going to go out of bounds. No, it's going to be saved in. Ball's going to save and bounce, but Howerton trying to make a play on it. Howerton's going to come up with it. Howerton passes it, trying to get – Oh, my gosh. Oh, my, my gosh. goodness. By an inch. Almost got the ball in the back of the net. And as Mackenzie Krieger is going to check back in this ball game. Man, Howerton smells it, man. She's had two Absolutely. good looks. Absolutely. And she had it right off the keeper's hands. Krieger's going to check back in for ball wag now. All right, great to see. She's all right. What a trooper Mackenzie Krieger is. They're going to slot Kendall Allen back up top. Paint goes to come out to the right. Goal kick's going to go high arcing, going to hit up an Upton Graf's foot. Upton Graf gets another high arcing kick. Howard gets it off. Boston will control it. Boston looking for the pass. Boston looking to switch the field. Gets it to Krieger. Howardson gets it off the drop. Howardson drops it back to Claire Horn. Horn trying to go up the right flank. Gets it to Allen. Off the foot of Allen. Krieger now with it. Krieger now gets another bump. They're yeah, going to call yeah. it. Good stuff. Krieger is a scrappy player. She knows she's going to be the focus. Yep. And they're really trying to key in on her, and she's not letting him, And she's just going to let him have it. 12.34 left in the – Yeah, that started in the back out of the air. Absolutely. Howard p picked that ball up uh, Absolutely. in the air. If you can get that ball out of the air, I think that saves a lot. Sydney Howardson might take it once again. Is. Shot is oh. off the crossbar, and they're going to call that a goal kick. Off yep. the oh, went off the oh, it's gonna be off the field goal unit. Yep. Man, Howerton now with almost almost making that keeper pay. You still think though the Braves are still in this game? It just takes one, they'll see it, and then they could make something happen here. Oh, if you just pulled up five minutes ago, it looks like Braves. They're really pressing, man. They're looking. They're Green looking wave, like they're they're gonna score have here. It. Green wave get the goal kick. Krieger with it off her foot, drops it back out to Howerton. Howerton now with the mm, pass. Unlucky. Ball's gonna be sw swallowed up. Massey with it. Massey trying to get up to Girk, and Howard's going to battle for yeah, it. They're yeah. going to call Howard now for the push in the back. Yeah. She's shaking her arms. There's a little bit of a push there. Should have been okay if she came up with the ball. I think yep. didn't really have a play on the ball there. Massey now will take the free kick for the Green Waves. We're approaching 11 and a half minutes left in the match. Green Wave lead this one three to nothing. Massey looking to send someone in. Massey's, though, might take the shot from here. <laughs> the ball's going to go off the head of Horn. Horn's going to try to settle it out of the air. Ball's going to trick out to Van Hoven. Van Hoven with a goal earlier in the game so far. Ball's going to take a touch, come all the way back out. Oh, Horn's going to deliver a high sweeping kick that's going to go over. Can Kendall Allen get to it? It's going to go off the green wave. Should be a Braves throw in here. Oh, it's a handball. Mm. Handball free kick for the Braves is should be a direct. So Sydney Howerton might be able to take a shot at from 40 yards out if she wants to. <laughs> I don't think she should, but she yeah. could. Looks like she might, though. Well, let's see it. Howerton's lining up for it. Howerton's <laughs> hand is up. She rides oh it in. Oh, my gosh, Off that's the a foot great. of Krieger, but it's going to go far right. Good stuff. What a play there. It's like all their shots are going far right, far left, and you're thinking, can they just get one in the back of the net? Just one. That's a good ball in. Yeah, absolutely. it was either Krieger or Allen. One of them, one of them stuck a foot on that. That's great redirect. That was uh, absolutely nothing a keeper can do if it's coming that fast, that low, and, and it gets redirected. So Absolutely. Ball's going to trickle back out here. Krieger's going to make a play on it. Ball's going to be swallowed up by the green wave. Krieger now with it. It's well defended. Krieger's going to get it back now, looking to pass. Almost falls on her yeah. feet, stays up. Yeah. They're calling it, though. They're calling all the physical plays now. It's hard to now get a play on it. Got to operate fast here. 3 nothing. 9.50 left in the match. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. We'll see what happens here. Howerton raises her hands. This is within her range. Howerton takes the shot. Oh, my gosh. Gonna go. oh, what a save once again by the Green Wave goalkeeper as it'll be a corner kick for the Braves. 
Ella Hilgenberg, this freshman, I have her probably at nine saves, and I probably could have tell her from where she's probably got about 10 or 11 saves so far in this match. Yeah, yeah, she's been busy. Absolutely. Maddie Kendall will take the corner for the Braves. Hitting this thing lefty. Nice job, Maddie. Kendall's going to get oh, it in there. Oh, that's a great ball in. Oh, man, it's going to trickle back out to Kendall. Or sorry, that was Coaster who took the corner kick. Oh, that Coaster. was, yeah, yep. Coaster's got a beautiful left foot. She's let, netted a couple left footed goals so far on the season. I was going to say that's impressive if Kendall swung the other foot on the other side. Keeters, though, going to get it out to Boston now. Boston trying to get it back out. Coaster will come up with it. Coaster trying to get a pass now. Ball's going to go up. Going to be cleared by Massey. All the way out to Claire Horn. Horn now trying to make a play on it. Horn tries to get a pass. Ball's going to go back to Massey. As Massey's going to hit it back, it's going to be out of bounds for the green wave. The ball's been Braves down this side of the field quite a bit. Absolutely. I mean, that's good. Coach, if you're Coach Moore, I feel like you're pleased with this effort so far, but you've got to get a couple goals in the yeah, back of the yeah. net. It'll fall. It'll As fall. Krigger's going to come up with it now. Krigger trying to settle it. Krigger's going to go back on her left foot, trying to spin it right. She got tumbled. Oh, man. Sydney Howerton, though, comes up with it. No call is made. Howerton to Krigger. Krigger now trying to get it past. Tried to thread it. Yeah. Massey now with the ball over the top. All Gracie. Gherkin's got to do is get a foot on it. He's got to take a And off to the races now. Keeters up, will go. defend it, cleans it up. What a defensive play by yeah. the lone senior. Job well done by Keeters. Keeters is now Gherkin's trying to be handsy with Keeters as Keeters is going to get it back to Gears, going to intercept it. Gears trying to get a touch on it now as Howard will bring it back up for the Braves. Howard gives it to Kendall. Kendall now looking to thread the needle herself. Almost got a pass in the window. Yeah. Boston now trying to come up with it. Howerton gets it. Howerton kicks it over, trying to kick it over the heads of people. Now Howerton's going to come up with it, though. Gets it to Kendall Allen. As we're going to get some substitutions for the Braves. Yeah, ball's bouncing around quite a bit. I wonder if Coach Moore is making this movie's empty and pretty much all of his bench besides Swart out. I wonder if that's just to get some players some minutes with the game go hanging in the balance or what. Ball's going to drop. Howard's going to get the head on it. Trying to get a feed. Maddie Kendall now with it. Kendall now with the beautiful ball. Can someone get to it? Greenwave yeah. goalkeeper Hildengrath is going to come off her line. She's had what a game for the freshman. Yep, smart play by keeper. Uh, Allen was uh, tracking that ball, but, yeah, just a little bit too high, too high up the field for her. With the punt is up, it is going to go up, and it's going to go to the feet of gear. Horn trying to make a play on it. Horn gets the ball down. Gears got it. Off to Massey now. Massey with a couple touches. That's all right. Make her face the other direction. Massey's looking to switch the field. Yeah, she. I've noticed her right foot is definitely stronger than the left. Yeah. Boston gets a pass on the ground. Going to go to the feet of Massey, though. You know, Coach Crawford, you just tell the boys this, and he's, he's dead right. Uh, it, you get... You get one of the players picks their heads up a little bit. You, you've got to drop because that ball's probably going to come along. If that, Absolutely. if you can keep their head down or keep them facing the other direction, man, close that space. Absolutely. You know, kind of pin them in. Horn's trying to get it out there. Howerton coming up with it as we're heading to the less than five minute mark of the match. Howerton gets it to oh, Allen. Allen to touch. Coaster. Can Coaster latch on? She does. Coaster now going to dribble in the corner. Now Coaster comes back with it. She can hit it with her left foot. Gets a shot right. on it once again. Swallowed up. And she's now at 12 saves, the Green Wave goalkeeper. That's a great ball by Kendall Allen, and then turned around and kind of ran up to make sure she supported the middle. Ball's going to be punted away, going to drop down. We're going to get some clouds once again here. Horn's going to come up with it now for the Braves. Horn looks to bring it back up, gets it off to <laughs> Kendall Allen. Ball's going to drop. Maddie Kendall now will try and make a play on it. Kendall has an option with Grace Hilarious on the left. Kendall's going to keep it, going to drop it back in, going to go off a foot. Going to take a what. bad bounce, and Massey's going to get to it now. As the Greenway, we're looking to empty their bench as well. Less than five minutes to go in the match. Braves trail right now, 3 nothing. Gears controlling it for the Green Wave. Krieger now comes up with it for the Braves. Gets it to Claire Horn. Horn now to Howerton. Howerton gets a pass, gets it off to Allen. Howerton battling for it. They're going to call that green mm. wave, and I think we're going to get the substitutions. Previous play, Kendall had the ball at her foot. Uh, Maddie Kendall, and I think Keeper was, ah, she was, she was riding that six. 
Matt, he's got such a range. I wonder if, if word gets in that, Matt, go ahead and take a crack for you. got Absolutely. You got all kinds of her brother had range like that. So oh, does she. yes. Logan Kendall. Man. Yes. The center back. Just wonder if she can catch her off guard a little bit. And now we're going to get some substitutions here as I believe we'll see who comes out for the Braves. Brooke Boston's one that they've met, waved off. Gracie Larison. Peyton Coaster's coming off now. And then Claire Horn. So the Braves kind of fill in some defense here. We might still see some scorings. We're still at 417 left in the ballgame. Yep, yep. And arrest some players, no doubt. Got another game this week, but, but another let's tough game too. See what else we can get going. Another tough game as it is against Muhammad Seymour, another Apollo Conference foe. Maddie Keeters gets it in, trying to sweep it back, go out of bounds, Greenway throw in. Yeah, she was kind of stuck there, didn't have an outlet, didn't have uh, – Howie was, was kind of covered by one of the Mattoon players, so she couldn't, couldn't really play one of her defenders. But I'm telling you what, Van Hoven throws it in here. This is the first game at home where the Braves have – I mean, Weirman, you haven't been here, but, I mean, the first <laughs> few games for the Braves, they've had to play Taylorville. We know Taylorville was a – they didn't even play half their team. Taylorville had nine players, 7-1 seven yeah. one, seven one game. Yeah. They play St. Therese at home, win. They play – they played, I believe, yeah, and that's two of their home games so far. Yeah. Not a lot of home games. Not a lot. I believe there's season. been three that I've called, and they've all been up in the five-goal range oh, for man. Braves wins. As that's going to go off the foot. Whew. Braves scuff out another one. It's Chloe Kunsel so far in the second half has had a couple saves. Right now, 10 in the ball game. As the shot came off of Shriver's foot. Shriver, sorry, foot. Yeah, she got loose. She had good ball. Uh, Chloe had had a little bit of an ankle covered, so so I mean it would have been a tough, tough shot. But I think Racy Larson's wide. about to check back in the ball game here. Oop. Gonna check in for Krieger. I think they're just gonna rest Krieger now. It's two minutes fifties out. I think it's a good call here if you're Mount Zion. I think, I think just want to make sure she's she's still feeling all right. I'm sure. I think now they're looking at maybe her ankle though. Hmm. So they're dropping the ball back. 2.43 left in the ball game. Ball's going to come out, going to trickle all the way out to Harmon. Harmon, another freshman on the team. Harmon gets the ball, trying to get to Howerton. Howerton has to come back for it. Howerton looking to find a pass, going to ricochet off. Howerton now just trying to get a pass on the ball. Gets it out. Or sorry, that was Keeter. Sorry. Keeter gets it to Howerton. Mm. Go off the foot of Kendall. Howerton comes up with it. Howerton gets the ball off. Going to go up to the green wave. Ball's going to step back. Ball's going to trickle back out to Gracie Larison. Larison now with a pass. Gets it off. Ball's going to come up to Eva Patrick now on the left mm. wing as the ball's going to go into bounds. Green wave throw in. Under two minutes remaining in the match, Braves still trail. It's one three nothing. Howerton's going to come up with it now. Howerton looking to make some touches. Gets the pass. Gets all out to Sasha Harmon. Ball's going to be intercepted. Ball's going to trickle back out. As Green makes a touch on the ball. Kendall now trying to get a pass. Gets the pass. Trying to get find Larison. Ball's going to come back now. Lunthrop gets the pass she wanted. Going to be intercepted by Keeters. Keeters gets the pass up. Ball's going to be intercepted by Van Hoven. Keeters once again gets it. We're about minute 10 left in the match. Green comes up with it. Green looking to pass. Green keeps it in bounds. Ball goes out of bounds off Van Hoven. Braves throw in. Yep, Keeter's doing a good job trying to find feet. Man, it might be a little bit stretched here, but, yep, keep playing. These kids are uh, uh, they're going to the right spots. As less than a minute remaining in the game, they're going to call that a handball off Larison. It'll be a green wave free kick. Might be the last play of the game here with 45 seconds left in the match. Kick is sailed in. Howerton's going to get a foot on it. Ball's going to trickle out to Maddie Kendall. Kendall to or sorry, Van Hoven, sorry, Howerton tries to get a crack on it. Mm. Going to come back out now. 
Ball's going to trickle out. Play will be made. Howerton now with the ball. 15 seconds left in the match. See if the Braves can make something happen here. Ball's going to trickle back. Howerton trying to make a play on it. Lonthrop with it. Passes it up. The ball's going to be controlled now by Howard. Howard, what a game so far. Ball's going to go off the foot of a green wave, and the sound right. horn's going to sound. Braves lose this one three to nothing. Thank you, Coach Weirman, for joining us for color commentating. Hey. Thank you, Lucas Reynolds, for the camera. We will see you on Thursday.